Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Joe and welcome to another episode in the TF2 YouTubers that you should be watching series. And if you don't know what this series is or you haven't tuned into previous episodes, essentially what this is, is I go over two to three YouTubers, maybe even four per episode, who I enjoy watching and whose content that I enjoy that make TF2 content that I feel like you guys would enjoy as well. So not only does this give you guys someone else to watch, but hopefully I can use my position in the community to help some other people grow and to like really expand the community and also give you guys a fun people to watch so I really do hope you guys enjoy the people that I mentioned in the video if you like this series do be sure to drop a like and without further ado let's get into the first person of the series so the first person I'm going to be speaking about today is known as Steg, and Steg is mainly actually an artist in the community, uh, you go over to their channel, there's a lot of sort of art related content, their last video of course being an SFM tutorial, but nonetheless Steg's content is actually really high quality. As you can tell his thumbnails all follow a very strong theme of a very sort of detailed SFM poster, he does very nice work in sort of visual effects on the posters as well, and his SFM tutorials and time lapses etc are really interesting to watch and I must say the tutorials have definitely helped me. So this is mainly for any sort of budding SFM artist out there, Steg is definitely someone you should consider watching. He does do content outside of tutorials and speed arts etc, one of which being Airshot Addict and I highly recommend you guys go and watch this video. Essentially it's kind of a mix between like a SFM and a gameplay style video where he transitions between cinematics that have been made entirely in SFM and back towards gameplay and it's really really well made like the production quality on this thing is absolutely insane and honestly I really do think he deserves more views so his channel link with everyone else featured will be down in the description below but yeah on to the second person so up next on the list we actually have Dicey and Dicey is a friend of mine who's also of course in the TF2 community and has about 1100 subscribers. Dicey's content is very very trading orientated and it kind of reminds me of sort of mine and Spikey's sort of genre of Team Fortress 2 where we focus on unusuals and like sort of top 5, top 10s etc of things that you guys would find interesting so Dicey's done a really good job on his videos and I definitely think you guys should check him out. So some really interesting trading content can be found on his channel. And third and finally on the list, last but definitely not least, we have Xenogene. And a few of you may already know that I'm kind of friends with Xenogene. In fact, I streamed with him the other day on his channel, and his content is actually really good. So for those of you who don't know, Xenogene is just a TF2 content creator who makes a, a wide variety of TF2 content. A series I really enjoy on his channel is called Hat History, where he just had, goes through the history and the origins of a bunch of hats in the game, and I find that really interesting interesting the way he sort of edits them etc. Also one thing to note about Xenogene is he has a killer accent and you guys will know what I mean when you go and check him out but as that is just about it guys I really do hope you enjoy those content creators let them know I sent you you know drop it in the comments pyro joe sent me etc I'm sure they'll appreciate it and do be sure to go and drop them a sub as well if you do feel like you'll enjoy their content which I'm sure you will. But guys that is just about it for this episode so thank you so much for watching and peace.